What? You mean I'm gonna do a, a, a good game? A, a well-known game? Why? Yes, I am. This is Ampillion, and let's play ourselves on a little uh, Final Fantasy. Uh, this is the original NES title, so everything's gonna be a little uh, basic, if you wanna call it that. As you'll notice, this game came back. Uh, it came out in '87, uh, released here in the states by Nintendo in '90, I believe. Uh, let's see. Continue. No. Um, I remember buying this game back when I was 10. Uh, <laughs> this game cost about seventy dollars, which was. If you look back now, it was kind of a ridiculous amount of money for a rather basic looking game, but we definitely got the money's worth out of this thing. Uh, I, I want to say if I've played through this about a dozen times back when I first had it. It was probably one of the most mature titles, I would say, that I had. Because it actually took some patience and some uh, strategy to make it through some of the caves and dungeons and whatnot. And this was back before the internet, so you kind of had to poke around and find things on your own. Um, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna have a like real crazy difficult party. I'm gonna pick one that I actually kinda wanna play. It's been forever since I've actually played a game. I mean literally probably 12 years since I've actually completed it. So uh, I'm gonna name my rogue or thief Nero after the crazed Roman Emperor who did a lot of cross-dressing and punished people for just about anything. And I'm gonna be the white mage. Gonna name it after me. Haha. <laughs> because I'd rather be the healing guy who beats people with a hammer than anything. So here we are at the beginning of the game. Uh, this is the first town castle area. I believe it's Corneria? Uh, somebody will, somebody will correct us on this. Uh, yeah. I'm not gonna talk to everybody in this game, but I'll talk to the important people, like the king here, who tells us we need to go rescue the kidnapped princess from Garland. We will get to that as soon as we grind a few levels, because otherwise we'll be mercilessly slaughtered. And this guy here tells us, hey, that Garland guy? Yeah, he's to the northwest. So, essentially, the guards know exactly where he is and where the princess is. But uh, I guess they just don't feel like going and getting it themselves. I mean, I guess the king just has soldiers for the looks. Hey, uh, you, tell me, yeah. Corneria, yeah, Corneria? Yeah, it's not Corneria, Corneria, I guess. Alright. Uh, I didn't want to talk to you anyway, thanks. Alright, so, let's get our equipment on. Uh, these guys, uh, wooden, wooden nunchucks all around. Uh, rapier for our thief guy, and this iron hammer for my white mage and we're out of here go pick up some armor what else we got uh... cloth for the mage and a wooden breastplate for Nero it's not really the most durable or mobile piece of thing uh, material we could make a breastplate out of but uh, who 
the magic is going to the only person who can learn magic at this moment. We'll get a cure, a harm, and a ruse. And we'll come back later and pick up the, the only other spell we can learn here. Alright, well, so we're moving down, moving out, and oh, hey, before I forget this time, we're going to equip our gear. Uh, last time I started recording for this thing, I entirely forgot to equip any of the stuff, and the fight took way too long. So, now that we've got our stuff equipped, we can start a fight. Hey, some imps. We're going to be beating up a lot of you guys here for the next, you know, couple hours. Well, not a couple hours, but for a while. Uh, the game does suffer from a lot of uh, grind fever. You'll get from one point to another. You'll realize that you're probably not the right level for a dungeon or a, a quest or whatever, and you'll inevitably have to walk around and fight stuff for a while. Uh, it seems to be a staple of a lot of the older RPG games, because uh, Dragon Warrior had you do it a lot too. Um, what else do we got here at the beginning? Uh, I'll probably go into the, this, the statistics screen in detail a little bit more, and we will I'm not gonna show you out every single fight but you will get the gist of what's going on here with the fight screen we do our little victory dance the monsters are dead and we've gained six points and some gold well not bad so let's go over this the statistics real quick or the status yeah so we've got our what level we are, how much experience we need. Are our various physical and mental stats on the left there? Uh, the damage and evasion. Oh, the, the evasion is going to come in important for uh, our black belts, as you'll see. Uh, the only difference here for anybody is the you know, different classes are going to have different numerical statistics that go up. I mean, your strength is your ability to hit or do damage. Your agility is your amount of extra attacks. Uh, int is for your magic use. Vitality is your hit points. Luck is your ability to get criticals. So, uh, I believe statistically, yeah, he should have the most luck. Alright. Uh, if I'm wrong on any of that, go feel free to leave me some comments about it, because I, I, I really don't remember exactly 100%, and I really don't want to surf through seven different frequently yeah, FAQs on GameFAQs just to find out, so, uh, anyway, uh, I'm about to hop out, we'll do some grinding, uh, level up a little bit. I was hoping I could find some more different enemies for us to check out, but no wolves apparently want to show up. Um, but yeah, I'll I'll do some grinding, level up. Uh, the next video will cover uh, actually advancing the plot. We'll go in and hopefully rescue the princess from Garland and do all kinds of fun stuff like that which involve <laughs> repeatedly beating people up getting things and bringing them back to other people well yeah essentially the game is up hey there's a wolf uh, the, he, essentially the game is a big fetch quest for a majority of the time but uh yeah we'll cover that hey look at that dead <laughs> Wolves just don't have the gold capacity that other guys, that bipeds have. Alright, so this is Amp. Uh, have a good one, and I'll see you in a little bit.
Peace.